you know, soak it all in. This is why you lift weights all season and all, all winter long. And the kids are very excited to play a, a good football team like Camp Point. So it's going to be it's going to be a good atmosphere. Well, you play Brown County and route every year, and you know it'd be great to play this new team. And you know, for me, I've got two more years to play them. Uh, but it's great for the seniors who've never played them, and it'll just be a great time to go down there and play in a new environment and somewhere we've never been. This may well be a radical scheduling departure for Triopia, but what the Trojans are not is strangers to the big stage. They've proven to be a team that time and again puts their business first. And the first order of business this Friday is slowing the Panthers' considerable rushing assets. They have three really good backs and they know how to run, but we just have to come in ready to tackle and ready to do our jobs and be focused this week. You know, we're going to work hard on tackling this week. Uh, those kids are probably two of the quickest as far as making people miss out in the open, and, and that's going to be a big challenge for us. But, uh, you know, like I said, I think our defense is uh, looking forward to that challenge. And it's a Trojan defense that hasn't been challenged to date, posting three shutouts and allowing on average less than three points per game right now. But the Panthers aren't the only team that is going to be tested defensively. Central Southeastern's unique five linebacker scheme and team speed will be the ultimate litmus test for a rebuilt offensive line in Triopia that's starting three sophomores. You know, their quickness concerns us, uh, definitely. Um, and it'll be a new challenge with the way that they play their defense. But, uh, I, you know, I think that our sophomores have done a great job up to this point. The good thing about us having sophomores online, they're surrounded by some veterans that, that have played in these kind of battles before. So I feel real good about how they're handling things, and, and I feel pretty good about our offense. We're starting to learn, feed off each other. Um, we're getting stronger. You know, and it really helps that Blake's on the line with us. And Jordy, of course, played last year, but Blake's been there. And he knows what to do. And, you know, if you have a question, he'll answer it and he can help. And, you know, he's a great leader. We just do what Coach Phelps tells us. I mean, he's our, he's our blocking coach and he's a great blocking coach. So he just tells us what to do and we just do it to the best of our ability.